Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a frustrating issue that many developers encounter in Visual Studio. Our viewer is asking, why can't I consolidate project SDK versions in Visual Studio? Let's dive into the details of this problem and explore some potential solutions. All right, guys, welcome back to another tech video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Now, don't forget to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you'll get to that resolution. Anyway, on to the video, cheers. Let's begin by understanding the build error you're encountering. The error message indicates a version mismatch between the system.net HTTP assemblies. This issue often arises when different projects reference different versions of the same SDK. In your case, some projects are using Microsoft.NET Core.App version 1.11, while others are using 1.1.2. To resolve this, you can update the SDK version across all projects. However, you might be forced to update all packages to ensure compatibility. When using the consolidation feature in Visual Studio, you may see a tooltip indicating that certain versions are unavailable due to constraints in your project or packages.config. To upgrade all projects to a newer SDK, open each project file and manually change the target framework version. After updating, test the build on all machines to ensure consistency. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. If you're having trouble consolidating SDK versions in Visual Studio, here's a solution that worked for one user. They edited their project file to target a specific framework and added a line for the latest runtime patch. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To consolidate SDK versions in Visual Studio, the user removed all NetCore package references from their projects. They then cleaned the solution, opened NuGet Manager, and installed the necessary versions after downloading the latest SDK. And that's it, guys. I hope the video has helped find you to that resolution and you are able to get through your problem. If you did, guys, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. It does help me out. And until next time, have a good one.